All right, they're about to head off now. As you see them leave the shore. Assassin leaves the shore there. Bok Choi, Scotty Watson, of course, came out of the uh, lower classes in the junior series and uh, skipped the clubmans and straight into the Formula Vs and doing a great job. Scary and Baden Sposen, he's that uh, one of those thorn in the side races. He's always there and thereabouts, loves it, gets out there. Of course, the single seater. As you can see, a, a mixed range of boats too. Some of them have two seats, so they carry a passenger. And uh, but, uh, Baden's one, just the single seater, offers to put the back seat in occasionally uh, for a ride, but nobody seems to take him up on the offer as they, uh, they head up to link up with the start boat once more. Heat number two for Formula V. Look for uh, Mason Dunlop who is in pole to try and get the jump on this field. A good spread of some 10 boats. Some great action coming to you lakeside here at Carapero today. Of course, do it all again tomorrow. The 98th running of the Massport Cup. We look forward to that one. We'll get a nice even start Start boat will bring them into line, get them up to speed, and then let's go racing. Away they go. Look at that jump I mentioned, uh, Mason Dunlop in pole one and jumps out on the field. Just needs to hold it into the first corner, get the confidence and put the foot down. But look at Baden Sprozen on the outside. Very even field as they jump and goal. Who's that getting lots of air? It looks like it might have been, I should have guessed it, Bok Choi. Scotty Watson knows nothing else. Baden Sposen on the outside. We'll get the uh, fingers working overtime on that trim button as uh, Julian mentioned before in the F1s, really hard to keep the nose of the boat down. Just ask Steve Priest. He'll tell you. And Mason Dunlop and causing havoc out in front. The big number seven. Now stretches out on Bok Choi. And Baden Sprozen back there and scary. Look at them rocking and rolling around that turn. But, uh, yeah, still gets plenty of air, does Bok Choi. Red flag's out. The red flag is way. We need to pick something up there. Looks like it's all. We've got one over. Red Hot Marine. Just talked about... Uh, can we get the rescue crew over there? As fast as they can, they'll make sure that everyone is uh, is okay. Bobbing up and down, we'll look to see. Didn't see what happened there. All right, so we're just uh, assessing the situation to see what's uh, going on, and we can see that uh, both are on board the rescue boat, so. That's good news for Simon Gard and his passenger, both on board, but uh, they will need to get on to top of that. So it will be all hands on deck to uh, tip this back over when it comes back to shore, and uh, they'll have to get the water out. Race 19, we're of uh, 39 today, so. Good to see the uh, sunscreen being applied.
by our visitors. Good stuff, being sun smart. All right, cast your eyes out onto the water to link up with the start boat. The flag has dropped. We are away racing, and as he did in the last one, Mason Dunlop shoots out, but a little bit more of a challenge coming on the outside of him. Gives it a big spray, though, and puts his foot down. Mason Dunlop, look at Scary way out, well, rocking and rolling. Bok Choi, as he did. Got uh, Scotty Watson, Corey Lowe in there as well. Uh, sorry, Anthony Elliott in there. Around the bend goes Mason Dunlop ahead of Bok Choi and then Scary. Back they go, they're all there in a the handful. A lot of rough water though. And repeat offender. Pete Thomas just makes it nice and easy. Down the back, straight they go, and causing havoc. Opens up the lead. Round goes Mason Dunlop. Oh, look at Bok Choi. Picks up. Oh, up. He's got pulled the front back down again, but uh, he only knows one way, and that is uh, don't keep too much of the boat in the water. But uh, he holds it in there just from Baden Sprosen on the outside of Scary. Mason Dunlop rocking and rolling, that is for sure. Down the back, they travel. Mason Dunlop leading the way. The gap closing. Look at Baden Sprosen trying to get up on Bok Choi and go right round the outside. This is where he had issues before. What a rough ride they're in there. Just puts the foot down and tries to catch Mason Dunlop. Scary on the charge, Baden Sprosen gets him on the straight line speed and goes up past Bok Choi. Yes, the wind certainly is picking up. Even Baden Sprosen pulls it back in the corner, lets Bok Choi up on through the inside. And we'll now have to try and pick it up again. He's not much sitting in the water of Bok Choi, I can tell you that. In these live stream pitches. Baden Sprosen back. Trying to get into some clear water. At the top of the course. Still getting plenty of air, bok choy. And then we go to scary. Bok choy takes a look over the shoulder just to see who's around. The white flag is out. One more to go for Mason Dunlop and causing havoc. All coming across the start-finish line. Leads them down the back, though. Mason Dunlop causing havoc. Picks up the back marker. That'll be repeat offender Peter Thomas. Still coming to uh, holding on to this boat. Doing a great job, though. Rebuilt it. 
Mason Dunlop though is leading the charge and will come down to pick up the checkered flag and what a great drive from Mason Dunlop well done to him and then it will be scary and bok choy a good drive to round that out